previously on Hell's Kitchen All Stars. All three of you are heading in to the grand finale. Yes! Final three. I feel fucking amazing. It was down to three chefs to battle it out for supremacy. I am the best chef in Hell's Kitchen. Chef Ramsay had a reward for his final three All Stars. You are going to be accompanying me at the seventh annual California Culinary Association Awards ceremony. This is basically a day in the life of Chef Ramsay. But as the award show kicked off, the winners are Michelle Tribble, Nick Peters, and Benjamin Knack. OK, already, here we go. Something weird's about to happen. Chef Ramsay had a surprise. This is the start of your final challenge. Everything I did in this competition comes down to right now. Off we go, ladies and gentlemen, please. It was an all or nothing cook off. We are cooking for our lives and this is it. To determine who would face off in the all star finale. Not getting into the final two is not an option for me. Guest judges from the Caesars Entertainment Group gave the chefs high marks. Beautiful dish, I would give Michelle a nine. Yes. Nick. Uh, one of my favorites, I'd give it a nine. A nine. Thank wow. you. And then Benjamin. I think that was a nine as well. We're tied again. And it all came down to the final dish. The first person is Michelle. <laughs> in second place, joining Michelle in the Grand Valley. Benjamin. Benjamin. <laughs> Michelle, I'm going to be the new chef in Las Vegas at Hell's Kitchen. Michelle and Benjamin then chose their all-star brigades. Nick. Please. I'm going to pick Jennifer. Wow. Dana. Yeah. Dana. Dan. Thank Dan. you. Millie. Yeah, Millie. Let's go. I'm going to pick Robin, Chef. Robin. I kind of knew I was going to go before Barbie and Elise. Last pick. But with only two chefs remaining, Michelle was left with a difficult choice. I don't want Elise. I don't want Barbie. I'm literally stuck between a rock and a hard place. So, Michelle, please give us the name of the final person in your brigade heading in to tomorrow night's grand finale. It's obviously a tough decision between Barbie and Elise. Michelle might be better off with neither of these two chefs. Chef, uh, the next person I'm going to pick on my team, she has a lot of talent. She's determined, proud. I'm going to go with Elise. Elise, wow. I'd rather Benjamin had picked me to be on his team because I probably would have given 250% to make sure that he had a great service. Which means, Benjamin, you have Bobby. Bobby, welcome back. Welcome back. I haven't worked with Bobby, so I don't really know how she works. She's kind of the wild card. You know, I, I don't know how she's going to do, but Elise is just bad energy. Just bad, bad, bad. Right, uh, Michelle, Benjamin, you have a lot of work cut out for you tonight. Yes, Chef. To go back to Hell's Kitchen now, get your teams up to speed because the final dinner service in Hell's Kitchen will take place tomorrow night. One of you will become the head chef of the flagship Hell's Kitchen restaurant at Caesars Palace Las Vegas with a salary of a quarter of a million dollars. This is it. May the best chef win. Off we go. Books for everyone. Now that both finalists have chosen their brigades. I'm gonna just write down the menu first. It's time to review the recipes they will be cooking. All right, so this is the menu. I'm trying to make this as easy as possible for all of us. So service runs smoothly. Millie, you are on the meat station. Cool. Dana, you are on the fish station. Woo. Do you always rock fish? Garnish for you. Like rock garnish. That leaves. Elise, the appetizer station, the hamachi crudo, it's kind of the similar plate to the salmon. Do you mind writing all this down so you have a checklist? I really don't want to be here right now. I'm not going to purposely fail, but I'm not going to lie and say I'm feeling that overzealous. I'm just going to keep my feelings to myself and do what I have to do. So everyone feel good about tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to turn up. Elise? Sound good? It's your show. 
I'm just, just saying, the like, question. Does it sound good? Did I not answer her? Elise is a sore loser. She's a bully. So I'm obviously going to back up Michelle 100%. You know, if, if I can't be in the finale, I'm going to help Michelle win. We're all going to be helping each other, working together, because yeah. at this point, it's just like putting out the best food possible. Yeah. I do think Elise is going to be an issue during dinner service. Michelle better have a plan B, because I think she's going to need to bust that out. Questions on menus for tomorrow. Are we cool with the Thai style quail? Does that sound good? Yeah. And then chicken's going to come off fish side? Fine. Yeah. The risotto looks really brown right now. Using mushroom caps? Yeah. It won't be that brown and be more like a. I mean, there's nothing green on it. Well, we can also finish with it if we want. Maybe scallions? Yeah. Chives inside and then scallions on top? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. I feel good about my team. No chef cooks by themselves in a kitchen. You need to be open to criticism and, and, and feedback. If you're not, you're never going to be successful. And then that's it? That's your menu? That's it. Fine. I'm feeling good about Benjamin's menu. If anybody should win this thing right now, it should be Ben. I'm about to ride or die for you, brother. Ride or die? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Elise really needs to grow up. She's in her 30s and she's acting like a middle schooler. Is that an appropriate thing to do when someone has a knife Don't in Don't act hand? like you've never had rubber in your face. <laughs> Frankly, I'm kind of over her being in the red kitchen, and I'm definitely worried she's gonna try and sabotage Michelle. Well, we're a team here. We're all looking out for each other. We all wanna win. With the doors to Hell's Kitchen set to open shortly for the first ever all-star finale dinner service. Ladies and gentlemen, we're open in 14 minutes. Y'all, come on, let's go to the pantry. Both Benjamin and Michelle are gathering their brigades for some final words of encouragement. So tonight, if you need help, ask for help. If you are confused, ask for help. If you need anything, ask for help. Okay, oh, we're a team. Yes, Chef. I'm here to make you guys successful, as you are guys are here to make me successful. You guys feel good? Yes. Yeah, baby! Chef. Woo! Bang it out for the blue team. Ugh. Come on, baby, get over here. Get over here, get the Team blue, come on. Get over here. I believe with all my heart in my team. This is one of the best experiences in my life, next to my children and my wife. When I win, it's gonna be for them. I am ready to go to Hell's Kitchen, Las Vegas. You got this, brother. We fucking got this. This is a really big deal, so just work with me. I know that I can be a little much sometimes, but I'm allowed to be that way today. Yep. And I need y'all, every single one of you guys, because I cannot do this by myself. Yep. Listen, the red team stacked, and the blue team, they have fucking Barbie and Robin. Woo! We got this shit. Team Michelle! Okay. Positive attitude. Yes, yes, this is all yes, I ever yes. wanted was to show Chef Ramsay what I made of, show him that I can run a pass. This one, bring it up to me in a pot. Okay. I know for a fact that I'm a better chef than Benjamin, so I need to prove to Chef Ramsay that I am the best chef here. Michelle, Benjamin, come here. Open Hell's Kitchen. Marino, stand by. One, two, three. Marino! Marino, open, open Hell's, Hell's Kitchen. kitchen. It's the first ever Hell's Kitchen All-Star Finale. This is really cool. And the hottest dining room in America fills quickly. Thank you, sir. Of course, Benjamin's wife and daughters and Michelle's sister and nephews. Is this hers? This is Michelle's menu, yeah. Are here to witness the most anticipated showdown of the year. To the finale. I think it's for you. Thank you, Marino. Study the tickets. Yes, okay. chef. Come on, Michelle. All right, everyone, listen up. You got two two tops? Two cauliflower salad, two risotto. Heard, Chef. Six minutes, Elise? Six minutes. Perfect. There's a reason I put Elise on this appetizer station. It's simple. If she's not doing well, I'll know immediately at the beginning of service if I need to kick her out or not. You want me to do the cauliflower? I got it. I got the cauliflower. Okay. I got it. I'm getting Michelle out the gate strong, but I hope she doesn't expect that if anything happens, I'm going to be running around. You need help on anything? I'm good. Heard Thanks. Because I'm not. Three and a half minutes to the window on two risotto, two cauliflower. Heard Three and a half heard. minutes heard. I'm not gonna do sabotage, but I ain't playing Captain Save a Ho neither. Elise, coming down hot. Cauliflower here, risotto here. Thank you. Yep. Elise, that's delicious. Say thank you. Shut the fuck up. Service, please. With Elise focused on the job at hand, Michelle's appetizers are flying out of the red kitchen. The risotto is so good. Like, the shrimp is so good. Guys, ears up. Yes, yeah, chef. Yes, yeah, chef. Two shrimp and grits, two sashimi. Yes, yeah, chef. Hey, your menu, my standards. Yes, yeah, chef. Shrimp and grits, how long? Four minutes. Thank you. I know I made the right decision on stations. We're going to be a working machine tonight. We are going to kill it tonight. How long? Two minutes. minutes. My team is, like, harmonious. Yes, yeah, chef. Thank you. How long to the pass? Two shrimp and grits, two sashimi. Coming with your sashimi. Big nights, standards. Yes, yeah, chef. I'm not here to come in second place, so every dish has to be perfect. Here we go. And that puts added pressure on everybody else. Jennifer, come when you're ready. Tasting and walking. Tasting and walking. You can tell Benjamin wants this so bad. And whatever Benjamin needs, I'm there for him today. Jennifer, this needs more seasoning. I'm glad you said that. Well spotted. I need more salt in here, please. Heard. I don't scream at people. They want to be treated like people. Let's go. Walking, Walking with grits. grits. But at the same time, I'm still pushing them. I'm still trying to get as much out as I can. Any more salt? More? Yeah. Make sure there's lots of love. Let's go. Make it perfect, Jennifer. Make it perfect. Wow, you know, talk about being thorough. More cheese, more salt. I need a shrimp and grits night now, Jennifer. He's killing me. Walking with grits. 
Again, uh, Jock, you can play. Hi, Jennifer. Service pickup. Oh my god. All right, everyone, listen up. Two hamachi, two risotto. Hurry. Hurry. Great. Dana, hamachi, two of them. Hurry up. What plates am I using for that? Is it in here? Um, what's this supposed to look like? I have all the ingredients, but I don't really know what to do with them. Don't burn me. I'm not gonna try to. The plate has like eight components on it, and you know, it has to be like artfully plated, one piece here, one piece there, one standing up here, one laying down here. Millie, can you help me? I need help with this plating. Do you need me to show you one? Yes, please. What, you don't know already, Dana? Michelle can't afford to get taken off the hot plate. Let's go. OK, I'll do one really fast with you. I want to win this finale, so... Dana, you need to pick it up and, you know, learn faster and get it done. The last thing I drizzle on is jalapeno oil. OK. Risotto up. At least you can walk. Yep. Thank yep. you. I already walked. Namachi. Where's the jalapeno oil? What? Dana, are you almost... Are you... Jalapeno oil. There's some over here. Open your eyes. That risotto is dying. Come on, guys. Push it. Nick. Helper. You guys good in the hamachi? Are you all right over there? Give me two minutes. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. We should never be held back on a cold app because you don't got to cook nothing. Michelle. Yes. We're in trouble. 30 seconds with me. Move your ass. Boop. Bye. That's never good when he pulls it into dry storage. Never. Ha! Hurry up! It's only 25 minutes into the final all-star dinner service. Dana, Hamachi! Give me two minutes. Jesus Christ. And Dana's surprising delay on cold appetizers. Michelle. Yes. We're in trouble. 30 seconds with me. Has Chef Ramsay wondering why Michelle is hesitant to take action? Move your ass. This is the most important dinner service in your entire life. Yes, I don't chef. want to see you blow it. Yes, chef. Okay, right mm -hmm. now you're the sous chef and I can't hear the voice. It's got to come together. Yes, chef. Tighten up a little bit. Yes, come on. Chef. Let's go. There really are no excuses. I should be able to keep the kitchen in order. Everyone else should be following me. I really need to hold the reins. I'll take the hamachi right now. You got it? Walk in with hamachi. Heard. Looks nice. Put it right here so I can check it. This look great. Service, please. Thank you. All right, next ticket. Dana, you got two hamachi plates working? Yep. Perfect. Hamachi. That looks incredible. Guys, count down on your next ticket. Heard. With Michelle once again pushing her brigade. Service, please. Appetizers are now flowing out of both kitchens. Nice, man. That's perfect, man. Enjoy. Thank you. And are receiving a stamp of approval from some very important guests. It was really good. Is it really good? Yep. So good. Good. Order in. Four top. Two risotto. Two octopus. All right. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Let's start the risotto. risotto. Come on. Barbie, count down at six, OK? Count down at six. Speed, Barbie, let's go. Let's do two risottos together, OK? Right, Watch your pants. Right. We're all working like a team right now, so we want to keep this momentum. But Barbie on abs. It's kind of a little bit. Um, I am probably the least experienced on the hot app station. Shit. I worked hot apps once. Watch out, watch out, chef. Where are the mushrooms? Oh. I probably should have told him. <laughs> and Parmesan. It needs Parmesan. More Parmesan? It needs to be cooked a little bit longer, too. But it's good, OK? You're doing good. OK. I don't want to do a bad job for Benjamin. I know he didn't choose me, but Ben is treating me with a lot more respect than I ever got from anyone on the red team. He wasn't the one that should have went home, though. Who do you think should have went home? Barbie. Guess it's a good thing Chef didn't think that. For us. <laughs> In the end, I want Benjamin to win. Where's the auto coming to the pass? Right here, please. Barbie, beautiful. Thank you. Service pick up. Here we go. Chef. You're doing a great Chef. job. Keep it up. Chef Michelle. What's wrong? Is this the way you want it? Yes, it's a finishing broth. It's the same broth that's in the risotto. They say that it's a little too too watery for okay, them. OK, I will, I will replate it for them. Yeah, it's far. It's pretty far, no? You'll replace uh, it? Elise, can you refire to risotto? It's Urgently. not your fault. They just didn't like the broth around it. Can you get rid of these for me? There are two guests in the dining room that weren't appreciative of the broth. So if they don't want the broth on it, that's fine. I'll refire it, and I won't put any on. How long on those two refire risotto? Uh, less than a minute out. OK, less than a minute. 
I cook some perfect risotto. Then it comes back because Michelle like poured broth on it. Way to go, Michelle. I guess I'll remake those perfect risotto for you. Don't fuck them up again. These are the risotto two risotto, no finishing stock. That's perfect. At least, perfect. I try. Being able to work with somebody like Elise, that's where you show you're a leader. Get her, Michelle. Elise, keep rocking those risottos. Gotcha. I love the control. Yes, Chef. I'm back again to disturb you just to make sure that everything is uh, of your liking. Yes. Yes, happy? Yes. I think. Yeah. I think it's seasoned well. I think it's great. Perfect. One of the details. There you go. To the fast. Two fast, two beef. Heard. Let's go. Chef, I got your two fillets. Beautiful, Robin. Thank you so much. I feel like I belong in the past. I feel like that's where my leadership stands up. Thank you, Jennifer. And because of that, we're coming out of the gates flying. Oh, shit. Look, you got rule C best thing. I mean, seriously, cook the fucking food right the first time, you know? Jennifer. Yes. I need you to pick up this bass. I need you to go rizzle it for another couple minutes. Let's go, let's go. Rizzle let's go. Oh, quickly, 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 quickly. Baste it, baste it, baste it, baste it. Cook them through, OK? Yes. Get killed here. I'm in the weeds right now, and it sucks because you know you want to do so well for Benjamin. I just need to focus and redeem myself. My bass is ready, chef. Let's walk. Let's walk. Walking, walking. Let's go. Let's go. Two bass, chef. Special. Jockey, you're dressing. No way. It's not cooked that. Fucking raw. Are you fucking kidding me? Can't happen like what this. Raw? Come on. Yes, it is. Look at that. This one's raw. This Shit. one's raw. Ben, I'm gonna need new garnish. Robin, I'm gonna need these kept warm. Benjamin, we are falling apart, young man. No, we need chef, some standards. No, not falling apart. It's one hour into the dinner service that we'll see either Michelle... I'll take protein, please. ...or Benjamin okay. win the all-star season of Hell's Kitchen. Can't happen like this. this. Raw. Come on. Yes, it is. Look at that. This one's raw. This Shit. one's raw. Ben, I'm gonna need new garnish. Robin, I'm gonna need these kept warm. Benjamin, we are falling apart, young man. No, we need chef, some standards. We're not falling apart. We need some standards. Come on, Jennifer, let's go. Holy shit. Can you walk, Jen? A uh, minute and a half. I love Jen, but you know what? Hurry the fuck up. Cook fast. How long? A minute, chef. How really long? Come on. A minute, chef. A minute to the pass? No way. A minute to a pass, chef. Chef, it's very close. Into the window in three minutes. I'm gonna prove to Chef Ramsay that I can bounce back. Whatever my brigade does, no matter what happens, I'm gonna push and I'm gonna serve the best food possible. I need bass to the pass. Walking. Walk. Walk to the pass, filet. Bass. Very nice, Sir. Jennifer. Very nice, Jennifer. Servers pick up. You know, that saying that you learn more from your failures than you learn from your successes, that's true. Jennifer, come on, keep this up. Hurt. Right. Let's go. Michelle, Michelle, I got four chickens all day. Ask Nick, I'm plating right oh. now. Check, Nick. One, three, four. Three salmon, three chicken, three steak. Three salmon, three chicken, three steak. I need about six minutes. Are you good? Three salmon, three chicken, three steak. Shit. Huh? What'd you just say? We're not doing a nine top. Hey, hey, I know it's not my kitchen, but I'm going to tell you something. We're not doing a fucking nine top. OK. Come on, Nick. When have you ever heard Chef Ramsay call a nine top? Sorry. No, no, sorry. I'm just telling no. you, I'm, I'm calling no, as it no, is. Yeah, yeah. She's not going to tell you, but I'm going to fucking step in and tell you. No, yeah. We are not doing a nine okay. top. <laughs> so you can throw it all out like a fucking buffet. Congratulations, Benjamin. No. Get some fucking finesse and just tighten up a little bit, guys. Okay. Your menu, my standards. Yes, but let sir. me tell you, the quality's not there. And when you stand around and shout out, three salmon, three New York strip, a six top, a nine top. You've seen how hard we work to get a six yes, top sir. out. We're not going to just throw food out a nine top. Yes, I wasn't sir. going to, chef. We all make mistakes. Just because Nick called out a ticket that wasn't on fire doesn't mean I'm not in control of the kitchen. Is that what you want? No. I no. Was... He's I firing it. it. Three salmon, three New York strip. Uh, my apologies, chef. Sorry. Newsflash, Nick, you lost yesterday, OK? It's not you today. OK, y'all, let's stop, sell this table, regroup, and we'll go on, OK? Yes, chef. Yes, chef. We have a new fire, guys. Two bass, two lamb, two beef. Yes, yes chef. Yes, chef. Pull your proteins. Get an extra one on, Robin. Yes, chef. Ain't playing today, guys. I feel pretty confident being on this meat station, you know? In order to get my black jacket, I cooked a lamb loin, and I'm confident cooking fillets. Chef. I got your two fillets. I'm slicing your lamb right now, Chef. Thank you. 
I just touched that. It's way under. Yeah. Robin, I need this play a little bit longer. It's, it's rare. Yeah, chef. How you doing, Robin? I'm not happy. Robin talks a big game about how she can cook some meat, and the next thing you know, she's sending up raw meat. She cray cray. Oh my fucking god. He thinks we're fucking fucking him. <laughs> cray cray. Robin, keep it pan hot. The water has to be frothy. Rizzole, rizzole, rizzole. Keep basting it, okay? Hey, check the fillets. They look scorched. I'm good. These Come are too, here. they're too burnt. They're, they're charred. That's they're, how they're, it's coming on. No, from... you gotta cook them on a lower flame. Do you have more going? Yeah. Can I walk? <laughs> no? How long for table one, please? How long, How long for one? Table one. one. How long a beef, Robin? I had five minutes. Where's the meat, Robin? This is the wrong dinner service to be slow. This is the finale. This is all stars. Hey, come here. Come yes, here. Chef. It's not the standard. She's absolutely fucking flat lined. When she starts making you look bad like that, I'm going to intervene. So come on. Come on, Robin. Fight back. Robin, you need anything? A volume? I don't do trust. This is embarrassing. I just me oh. I don't even fucking know what we're doing right now. It's always unfortunate when you have to let someone go, but unfortunately, Robin needs to step away from the meat. Robin, how long? I can. I, I'm ready. You working? Okay. Hey, young lady, touch the beef. Touch it. No, um, tell me. Go on. It's it's under, chef. You know it is. Yeah, chef. So you sabotage him. No, chef, I would never sabotage him. It was a fuck up, chef. Oh, really? Yes, chef. I don't want to fuck him. I'm not here to sabotage him. Right, you don't care. Oh, my God. I'm not going to answer any more questions. Why not? Because everything I say is wrong, chef. Oh, I so just... what you did was right. Sorry, chef. Two beef. Let's go. Get me Reno, please. To apologize to 21 and 4, please. Come on, guys. We got to get this out. How long fillets? How long in those fillets? Just get them hot. Just get them really hot. Okay? The thing is, if I yelled at Robin, she would have imploded. She doesn't handle that well, and I did not want Robin to fall apart. I need Robin to bounce back. I got two different feels. This one was the one I think. That one's good. Okay, that this one, one needs to go a little bit longer. Get resting. these going right now. Dana. Yes. Fuck me. What's wrong? Cook that for 30 more seconds. Heard. Skin side down. Base it. Heard. Use the butter. Working up with the pass, you have to stay focused. You have to know what you're doing right now. You have to know what you're doing next. Nick, three minutes on garnish on the next ticket. Heard. And you have to know what everyone else is doing. After this, is salmon chicken New York. Go ahead and get that started, OK? You don't want to go right with it? I don't want to be start, stop, start, stop. So Heard. get going Heard. on the next table. Yes, chef. Thank you. I'm working my absolute hardest to make sure that I'm doing everything I can to keep this kitchen in order. Yo, make sure I get everything up at the same time, please. Yes, sir. Keep it up. Keep the rhythm. Keep going. Yes, chef. Heard. I want to make sure that we keep our momentum going. We need to keep rolling. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Right? Yes, yes chef. chef. Yes. Because I need my team to stay strong so our dinner service stays strong. Salmon. Right now, right it's now. beautiful. It's ready, chef. Don't do that. Good? Yeah, it's fine. Okay, thank you. All right, two minutes on the next ticket. Let's go, lamb beef. Behind, chef coming out behind. That's perfect, thank you. Lamb chef. Is that great now? Is it hot? It's not roasting hot, it's just like cold and fucked. Robin, this lamb is not warm. Robin just came up with beef, and it's cooked perfectly, but now the lamb, it's cold, like, what the fuck, man? Do you want me to Get put it in the, the pan? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Behind. Hey, young lady, I know you've given up. I haven't. I have not given up, chef. Get it in the pan. Get it I'm hot. There's a lane right now again. Young lady, right now. Young, come here one minute. Did you just put the lamb into the pan where the beef came out of? Yes, because it was hot. Oh, my God. The one thing that there is never a shortage of in Hell's Kitchen are saute pans. Benjamin, come here. Can you see? It looks like he's really angry about the service. I thought we were going to try our best to make Benjamin look good, not embarrass him. You just put yes, the chef. lamb for this next table into the pan that you just cooked the beef from. So it's to heat it up because the pan was already hot and had hot butter in it, chef. I won't do it again. How I apologize. How fucking dare you? I apologize, Benjamin. You stick the lamb inside the beef pan. That brown that. caramelize the spice and the yes, Get out.
you just put yes, the sir. lamb for this next table into the pan that you just cooked the beef from? So it's heated up because the pan was already hot and had hot butter in it, chef. The spice and the oh, Get yeah. out. I don't want to get out, please, chef. Get out. Okay. Are you kidding me? Are you guys fucking kidding me right now? Chef Ramsay kicked Robin out, and um, I fully agree with him, 100%. Chef Jockey, how long? Two lamb, one beef. Two minutes. You know, the next thing I'm thinking is like, let's fucking let's get this food out. You know, just because she's not here and she's out of the kitchen, still have fucking guests to feed. Send a lamb up. Send a lamb up. Lamb on your right. Let's go. Let's go. This is not how I want a last dinner service to be. Chef Benjamin, can I please come in and finish service, please? No, we don't need you. Thank you. All stars is about redemption. Let me back in, chef. Like, let me back in. I want to come back in and finish with my team, chef. And whose team is it? It's Benjamin's team, Why chef. Why don't you ask him if he wants you back in here, then? Benjamin, let me finish strong for you. I didn't mean to fuck you. Let me finish strong for you. I want you to win. No more mistakes. Jump on with Barbie now. I could see it in her eyes that she wanted it. She wanted it just as much as I did. I'm here. I want to work. Come on. That's it. I had to respect Robin for that, that she didn't want to give up on me. Let's go. It's our last ticket, guys. Two lamb, yeah. one beef, one bass. Got you. Come on, Robin. Don't give up on me. Let's go. Never. Last table. Let's go. Two bass, two New York, and then we're good. These last two tickets have to be perfect. We need to end on a strong note. Y'all got it? Yes, sure. All right. Two bass. Chef, to your right. Very nice, Jennifer. Two New York, how long? 15 seconds. You're not going to cook another entree in Hell's Kitchen after this one. Come on. Get that lamb hot. Let's walk. Let's walk. Walking garnish. Walking right behind. behind. Chef behind. To your right with bass. Come on, Millie. Yes, Chef. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yes, Chef. Come on, Benjamin. You got this, homie. All right. You want it down? I like the, this. Is it beer. good? It's good. Is it good? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it definitely must be good. Good fucking job! <laughs> I'm super grateful for everyone on my team for trying their absolute hardest today. I don't need hugs. Thank you so much. No matter what happens, I'm you know super proud of myself for making it into the finale. I got further than I did in season 14, and I wish Benjamin the best of luck. He was a great competitor. He really brought it and challenged me a lot here in Hell's Kitchen. Eat all the vegetables too, huh? I'm not gonna eat the vegetables. Is the lamb as good as Daddy makes it at home? Yes. It's really good, huh? Thank you, brother. Yeah, man. I fought hard every moment I was here. Thank you. I had a lot of things blow up in my face, but I didn't change course, kept going, kept pushing. Hopefully, Chef thinks it's enough. He's the only person that, that knows. Like, I can't get into his brain, you know? I wish I could, because then I'd be much smarter, but. Wow. As we all know, Tonight's dinner service in both kitchens definitely had some hurdles, right? Yes, yes sir. sir. But both Michelle and Benjamin pushed through it and held their ground. Uh, you guys did a really good job. Well done. Thank, Thank you, you, Chef. Now, I have in my hand the common cards from tonight's dinner service. So, I've got some studying to do. Michelle and Benjamin, say goodbye to your brigades and both of you head to the dorms. I will call you both when I've made my decision. Hi. So proud of you. Good job. Yeah. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you. Elise, thank you for everything. Bye. I feel like I fought the most. I started hard out of the gates. I put up good food. And I pushed my team as much as my team could handle. Good job. How'd you do? Uh, I think I did well. I really think that everyone in the dining room was happy with my food. I put my heart and soul into all those dishes, so I'm feeling very confident right now. We're done. Good luck, Michelle. Good luck, Benjamin. Michelle, that's a five for five. Thank you, Chef. Yes! yes. Michelle. Yes, Chef. Beautifully cooked. Thank you, Chef. Your dish will be featured on the menu. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thank you, Chef. We need to keep rolling. Yes, Chef? Yes, yes, yes Chef. Chef. Them, right? Yes, yes Chef. Chef. Yes. Benjamin, is that good? I'll give it a five. Yes, Chef. Incredible. Thank you, Chef. Ben. Yes, Chef. That lamb is beautiful. Thank Absolutely you, Chef. Absolutely beautiful. Dish that is cooked on point. It's the salmon. Benjamin, congratulations. Thank you, Chef. 
Jennifer, this needs more seasoning. I'm glad you said that. Well spotted. This is Michelle. Michelle is chef. I'd like to see you and Benjamin. Upstairs in my office, please. I've made my decision. Thank you. Benjamin! Are you ready? I'm ready. You ready? I, I guess so, no matter what happens. Good luck. Good job. Good luck. Good job. You did a great job this year. Ah! It's gonna be exciting. Yeah. Woo -woo. Oh my god, here we go. I tried, man. I'm sorry. I did not sabotage you. Hopefully, you'll be opening that door tonight. Hi, Chef. Welcome. Right, you two, welcome. What an incredible journey. Benjamin, how are you feeling? I feel great, Chef. I had the most amazing experience of my life. It's yeah. been unbelievable. Michelle, how are you feeling? I feel great. It's been a good journey, a lot of struggle, but it's all worth it. I've put a lot of thought to what I've observed, not only tonight, but your entire time as All Stars. For the first minute we met, Benjamin, back to season seven. Absolutely delicious. Thank you, Chef. Great dish. Benjamin, you made the final six. Thank you, Chef. Well done. Benjamin. Yes, Chef. That meat's perfectly cooked. Thank you, Chef. You and your winning dish are going to be on Epicurious. Do not give up. I promise you, Chef. Thank you. Michelle, season 14. Uh, how old are you, Michelle? 22. 20 young. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's delicious. Yes. <laughs> that is perfection. Great job. <laughs> the winners. Oh my God. The food looks great. Thank you, Chef. I've never had a 22-year-old this strong. You should be very proud of yourself. I am, Chef. Thank yeah. you. My decision tonight was very, very difficult. But after much deliberation, I have reached my decision. And so it's time for the two of you to step up to your doors, please. Yes, Chef. This is definitely a life-changing moment because I've been working my ass off to get to this point in my career. I have so much to prove, I have so much talent to show. This is what I came here for, to open that door and to get the head chef position in Hell's Kitchen Las Vegas. I came back here to work for Chef Ramsay. That is the only reason I'm here. I'm ready for it. I want that door to open. I want to have that opportunity to fight every night for him. I'd go to war for him. The chef whose door opens will be the head chef at the flagship Hell's Kitchen restaurant at Caesars Palace, Las Vegas, with a salary of a quarter of a million dollars. Very carefully place your hands on top of your handle. On the count of three, I want you to turn the handle and push. One, two, three. <laughs> the chef whose door opens will be the head chef at the flagship. Hell's Kitchen Restaurant at Caesars Palace, Las Vegas, with a salary of a quarter of a million dollars. On the count of three, I want you to turn the handle. One, two, three. Head up high. Yes, Chef. Okay. Thank you. You did great. An amazing career ahead of you. Thank you, Chef. Never forget that. Thank you. Okay? It's not fun losing, but in the end, the winning's not the most important thing. It's fighting as hard as you can, staying clear-minded and being positive. Exactly. Good job. You know, you learn from your mistakes, but if you regret them, you'll never be able to fight. You'll never believe in yourself, and you'll never believe in the people around you, so I have no regrets. <laughs> Come here. I can't even comprehend how happy I am right now. I'm the winner of Hell's Kitchen All-Stars. Like, oh my god. This moment is everything that I've been working for in my life. 
<laughs> Jeff Ramsey, thank you so much for believing in me and pushing me as hard as you could because you knew that I could deal with it. You had confidence in me. It really goes to show that if you work your ass off, you can really accomplish anything you want to. Ladies and gentlemen, our House Kitchen All-Stars winner, Michelle! <laughs> Thank you, Chef. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Right. I'm so happy right now. This has been such a long journey, but it's definitely been worth it, for Amazing. sure. Amazing. <laughs> Ever since I could remember, I wanted to be a chef. And I've just been working my ass off for this for so long. All of that hard work has finally paid off, because, oh my god, I'm the winner. That's crazy. Right, Michelle, one yes. more final challenge. It's not a difficult one. But it is a tradition here in Hell's Kitchen. Please, there we are. And hang that up. Okay. Let's go. Welcome to the Hall of Fame. Love it. Good luck, Michelle. Amazing. Having the youngest of all stars step up and win this competition is a testament to Michelle's talent. At a very young age, she has already proven she is driven, creative, and commanding. She will be a great asset to Hell's Kitchen in Las Vegas. I'm so proud of you. I almost started crying. I'm so proud of Michelle. She deserves this. She's a kick-ass, hard-working chef, and she had to overcome so much this time around with all those fucking assholes in her kitchen. I knew uh, you were going to win. You knew I was going to win. Gonna win. How did you know that? Uh, oh. How did you know? We can't tell anybody. It's still good. She does cook good. <laughs> Congratulations, buddy. Good job. <laughs> nice service. I'm super proud. For you in London, man. Yes. Yes. I'll Don't be, be fucking late. late. No, I'll, I'll be waiting for you. You okay, Elise? Hey, you're on the women's team. I, I really don't have anything to say right now. I didn't come here not to win. <laughs> hey, can I get a real drink, please? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, one more time to our first time Hell's Kitchen All-Star winner, Michelle. Well done.